coming out of Canada. This trophy has marked itself safe from being stolen by Dirty Mike. But let's talk about the real deal out here this afternoon. Trucks going wild, third year in a row out here at Moses Lake, and we are ready to set it off. It's moments away from getting started. The crowd's behind us, the trucks are all lined up, but let's talk about the big things. The bounty hole and the freestyle. $17,000 on the line out here this afternoon with here's how it breaks down. Five grand to first place, 2,500 to second, and 1,000 to third in each competition. The money is insane. The competition is awesome. We've got a Canadian invasion. There's a handful of trucks that we've never seen out here today. And there's also a bunch of the local boys that seem to have gotten a lot bigger and a lot faster. And it's all going down in just a couple of minutes. Tim, so three years ago when we were here for the first time, we saw you, and you had like just this badass truck, and it was ripping, had a great time. Right. Then we didn't see you last year. What happened? Right. Well, I tore it all apart and uh, built a new truck. You did what everybody else does. You got a yep. truck that's awesome. There's nothing wrong with it. Let's take it apart. Yep, exactly. <laughs> so all the parts went off of that, and we put it on this one, and... Made it another good truck. Here, All right. So, so you got you yeah. got with Dusty a little bit, mm -hmm. right? And yeah. then and you guys worked together on this. And yeah. how long ago did you get it done and ready? Uh, about a month after that, at, from, I got it from Dusty Ramature, and uh, yeah, yeah, it took about a month to put it back together and stuff, and. Uh, we did a lot of testing and tuning with it and get all the bugs out of it and now we got it to go in where it's doing great. You got a couple events under your belt coming yep. into today, right? Yeah, I got about four events under my belt right, right now with this truck and uh, feeling comfortable? Yeah, feeling pretty good. <laughs> as good as you can. Uh, yeah, exactly. With this thing, so. Are you signed up for the bounty hole and the freestyle out here Correct. today? Yes. Nice. Yep. It'll be, it'll be awesome. Hey man, you were a standout. One of the guys that we met the first time, yep. and it's great to see you back out here great. this year. Nice to see to you guys. It. Yes, Thank sir. You. So this afternoon we've been talking about the Canadian invasion, and that's Hell you guys. Yeah, Again, you dude, I love it, and you brought some friends with you this time too. That's so. right. Yeah, we had such a good time last year, we decided to bring a whole bunch of our buddies. we got a bunch of snow wheeling trucks down here, mega trucks, everything. I think it's really cool because 
um, I don't know, it just adds something different, yep. you know? It does, and I think you, what you did last year, you can tell by the trucks that are here, everybody's stepping their game up. Yeah, know? there's a lot more serious trucks this year, for sure. They're bigger this year, for sure. Absolutely, there are some serious competitors. A lot more bigger tires. Yeah, everything. More, like, like the horsepower sounds, when they're moving around, yep. they're louder. Everything. And that's exactly what the goal was, you know, when we started coming back here a couple years ago. And it's just fun to see the evolution. Man. Totally. So yeah. tell us what, so uh, starting starting with yours. Yep. So, so there, we brought we got uh, that. Flyboy down right yep. there, and then yep. we brought Snot Rocket down, yep. and then Joel's other rock bouncer, a Mazda. Mazda? Then, yeah. yeah. And then we got the Dodge, and then the other and um, then the big one. buggy, and then the, I think it's a Dodge right there with nice. the diesel in it. So. Very cool, man. So how far is that for you guys? You said? It's not too bad. It's 250 miles. Okay. Right to so, our house from here. So, okay. So, that I mean, that's like your backyard. Yeah. You know, the, the guys that we talked to up in Canada are used to driving a long ways. Yes. So this is like a backyard one. That's why you, we so. like it. Everywhere we go, it's, you know, miles, like 22 hours. Hey, like that. I want to ask you, though, how is it crossing the border? Is it? Honestly, the border is fine. Everyone stresses about it as long as you have your documents and your truck's clean it's easy very just cool. can't cross if it's dirty <laughs> yeah is it harder coming in or, or going back it's, into it's Canada it's easy coming in it's hard going home hard going home yeah interesting isn't yeah. it yeah it's ah. weird that way let's talk about the outfits dude because that is a breath of hitman heart if you're not a wrestling fan you're not uh, part American best there is best there was best there ever will be yes sir you know lot, lots of good wrestling and so the shirt and the shades yeah ten dollars ten dollars no way yes sir dude you, that's the thing that if you don't buy that for ten dollars the next day you're going i should have bought it yes, sir. and then you go back and they're gone oh so somebody like you came and bought dude, it i see someone walking before <laughs> them before i even got there so i had to go get myself one for my me and my partner here we're in the bounty hole yes brett the hitman heart absolutely winners the whole heart foundation yes, i dig it Brandon, so we're out here, dude, for the third year in a row. This is awesome. Weather's beautiful out here beautiful. this week, and we got that going for us, right? Yeah. And uh, we were just talking before we fired the cameras up, man. It looks like the, the trucks are bigger this year, you know? Yeah, the, the competition's growing. Canada brought down six guys, and they're all big. Yeah, it's pretty. It's like a Canadian invasion. It's a yeah. truly international thing international going on out here event. today. So yep. uh, tell us about, we added an extension to the bounty hole this time. Made it a little bit, was it to make it longer, harder, more difficult? What was it, was, the idea? it was to make it more difficult. We got some of those people, oh, oh I'm on 35, 400 horsepower. I, I got a shot. No, the fuck you don't. <laughs> so, here at our Windermere start line, we got what's called the gatekeeper. And we're calling the gatekeeper because if you deserve to be here, you're going to make it through. If not, you're probably going to be stuck somewhere in the middle. You know, even some of these guys like Tuta who do deserve to be here are probably going to be stuck in the middle. If they make it through, you know, then we follow the traditional bounty hole route, which is about another 500 feet out that way. So up over the access road where he's rolling out of right now, yep. and then into that. Okay. So there's a couple turns, nothing too drastic. It's not going right. to Okay. I like that. I like that. Anything, what's new? I mean, besides that, that's a pretty cool thing. And then we got freestyle after that, of course. Yep. We got three Dodge mega trucks, all Canadians. We got a rock bouncer on Sherp tires. Yep. yep. Um, who else is new? Timitation 2, it's his first appearance here. Oh yeah, because he was here the first year yep. we came with his other truck. With a different build. Yep, brand new uh, Dusty Ramaker yep. build. Outside of so. that, you know, it's about the same, a lot of repeats. Probably half the field or better is repeat. Uh, well, that's about normal, that's good. Yeah. That's Fine. the way to do it. Yeah. Cool, man. All right, I know you're getting ready with the driver's meeting in yeah. about 10 minutes. We're looking forward to that yeah. and we can't wait to kick this thing off. Thank you, brother. Great yeah, to be thanks, a part of it thanks again. Thanks for coming. Awesome, man, awesome. Uh, that was probably, we've been here for three years, right? And I know you've been here forever. Yeah. But that was, as far as we're concerned, the wildest pass through there that we've ever seen. So I hope it's the wildest pass that anybody ever sees here because uh, I didn't like it. No? No, heck no. That was, uh, that was slow. I knew it was coming as it started, and I went fully over. And uh, the only thing I thought was, I don't want to watch my wife and my kids. I don't want them to watch me go all the way over in this. I did I did not like that. No, and that'd probably be the worst place for it. There, too. That is a jello mat over there. It's thin the viscosity of it is thinner than grease. And it's it's probably 10, 15 feet of just I mean thin stuff. So yeah. Alright. Yeah. Do you think that the fender peeling over and peeling back might have might have just been enough to put you back on all four? <laughs> I've watched enough videos to where I think that's the only reason I came back right? on all four. 100%. Yeah. All fender. 
No, that's cool, man. Yeah. Hey, for whatever reason, there might be other reasons too. You know I have another I mean? thing. Yes. I have not driven this truck last year. Oh, really? I have not. I've loaded on and off the trailers, no pulls, no testing. I haven't made one event. This is fresh off the trailer, no test passes, nothing. Nice. Did it. Well, yeah, I'd, I'd wait another year and just come yeah, back no, and do it again. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. That was not fun. No. Yeah. I know, dude. Hey, man, yeah. good to see you laughing yeah. about it. All yeah. good. I know yeah. you're breathing a sigh of relief now. Yeah. And all that, so, but congratulations again. Yeah. Good job. Well no done. problem. Thank you. It's not any money, and I don't even—I didn't have time to make a trophy or anything. But it's an award for you dumped the most dirt down the back of my shirt that went down my back into the crack of my ass nice. in 20 years. That's ever happened. So congratulations! That's an that. honor. I, That's I, awesome. I don't know if it's an honor, but I'm glad you say it, dude, because nobody else has done it. I, I want it. you to be the only one that has that. Honor. I bet you do. Hey, man, it's always good to see you guys. Yeah, Thanks you for too. bringing the whole crew. Absolutely. And uh, I gotta—I gotta get you some stickers. Yes, let's we'll send do you it. back to Canada. Yep. Love Hide it. those things when you go across the border. Yes. All right. See you. <laughs> All right, 26.6 points. We got Joel. Yeah. Nice job. Five grand cash. Five grand. That's a good one. Shit, yeah. Oh, yeah. Wait, wait, wait. $17,000 uh, for us, right? Better. <laughs> Truck's going wild. 17 grand Freestyle Badass 2024. There it is. That's a heavy trophy. Boom. So, are you breathing a sigh of relief yet? It's done. It's, it's done. You know, it's done. it doesn't take a couple of minutes. I know sometimes, like it, when it it's done, it takes about a week. <laughs> yeah. By the time yeah. you catch up and just like revel in the moment. Yeah. Yeah. Do you, good moments out here this weekend. Thank you. Dude. Thank you guys for you, coming. You were saying it during your uh, your presentation. One of the wildest events out here so far. Yep. So it was great to be a yep. part of it. I, I, honestly, I think bit of, Trucks Gone Wild's got a lot to do with it. Thank you, you brother. Know? Well, thanks yeah. for bringing us out. Yeah. Again, dude, we had a blast. Yeah. See you soon. I hope so. Yeah. <laughs> wow, bitches! See, she even knows oh, what the hell to say. We know. We know.